Red flags are flying on Alabama beaches this morning, two days after Tropical Storm Claudette swept across the Gulf Coast. Some areas in Mobile County dealt with flooding as the storm passed by on Saturday. A tornado also damaged the Cedar Point Fishing Pier near Dauphin Island. Megan Mackey is live from the causeway this morning, which also saw some flooding over the weekend. Good morning, Megan. Good morning, Bill and Jessica. Yeah, LDOT shut down parts of the causeway in Mobile over the weekend during tropical storm Claudette. Now that water has since receded, but we saw similar problems on the causeway heading into Dauphin Island. In terms of damage in Mobile County, that was where we had one confirmed damage report from a tornado. A board from the pier at Cedar Point Fishing Pier just north of Dauphin Island hit the windshield of a vehicle that was parked there, causing some damage. Now we were on scene shortly after it happened around 3 o'clock Saturday morning and we're told that four Unfortunately, no one was injured. The island itself also saw some coastal flooding, particularly on the west end. But the mayor, Jeff Collier, says that was expected from this storm and says, thankfully, there were no other damage reports. Now, he is also encouraging people to download the Dauphin Island app here. He's going to be giving evacuation warnings as well as show you some of the fly conditions. This is new this hurricane season, and it's free in the App Store and on Google Play. Reporting live, I'm Megan Mackey for WKRG News 5.